Harvest season in Siouxland is in full swing. And farmers are hoping to finish the year with a outer breakdown. But for those who do, the search for parts at times can be difficult. That's right. And KCAU 9 News reporter Nick Wilson is telling us what obstacles farmers are now facing, plus how implement dealers are working to make it a successful harvest. It's all our top story at 6. Nick? As Siouxland farmers plow through the harvest season, they worry about having available equipment and parts if things go wrong. Rob Sorensen works on his family's farm. He has not had equipment issues so far, but worries if his machinery stopped working, repairs would take too long. Oh, it's it slows us up tr tremendously. We're uh, right now we're ahead of schedule, but I mean a big breakdown could put us back a whole week to two weeks, and that would put us way behind again. Preston Hoosier is the store manager at AgriVision Equipment. He says they implemented new procedures to prevent a parts shortage. Parts-wise, we're sitting pretty well. Um, we're, we're still able to get our weekly stock orders. Um, deers work through their backlog and put weekly stock orders back in place, which has helped. Um, we're able to get emergency stuff overnighted to us. Um, parts availability has not been too terrible of an issue. Keith Siebert works in the parts division of S&S Equipment. He said maintaining enough parts is not a perfect science. I think it's a, not necessarily even a shortage thing. It's almost an every year type of thing where we're just more or less guessing on what's going to break in the field. So we just do our best to try to keep as many parts on hand as possible without getting, you know, way overstocked. AgriVision and S&S Equipment say they do not currently have a parts shortage, but they expect demand for combine parts, rubber products, and other materials to remain high during the harvest season. Nick Wilson, KCAU 9 News.